There are some footballers who are made in twos and then put in different parts of the world and we're going to be looking at a few of them in this video today. Here are 10 lookalikes in football that will blow your mind. And we start with Zlatan and Nihad Dedovic. Nihad is a basketball player from Bosnia and he looks a lot like Zlatan. I mean, just take a look at that uncanny resemblance. On top of that, they're just about the same height. Ibra is 6 foot 5 while Nihad is 6 foot 6. You could be forgiven for mistaking these two for brothers. So it was like that reporter who asked Nihad if they were related was asking for all of us. But Nihad cleared the air saying that his father had never even been to Sweden where Zlatan is from. But Zlatan being Zlatan replied that his own father had been to Bosnia where Nihad is from. Deduce from that what you will. Now there's one guy everyone says is the heir to Zlatan's acrobatic throne and that guy is Erling Haaland. He too has a lookalike, Damon Targaryen from Game of Thrones. Come on, you see it, don't you? No wonder Haaland is usually so cold and lethal in front of goal because with him, winter is always coming. Since we're talking Premier League strikers, let's also mention one of the hottest properties in the land right now, Alexander Isak. The Newcastle record signing has a striking resemblance with American actor Eddie Gathegi. An explanation for this resemblance seems far-fetched at first because Eddie is American and Isak is Swedish. But when you trace them back to their roots, it starts to make sense. They both have East African origins. Isaac is of Eritrean descent, while Eddie is of Kenyan descent. Isn't that interesting? You know what else is really interesting? The resemblance between Roma legend Francesco Totti and British adventurer Bear Grylls. There's no groundbreaking discovery to explain this one, but well, they're both European, so there's that. But if that one caused you to gasp, then take a look at this one. Eden Hazard and Nick Jonas. Hazard, as you know, is Belgian and Nick Jonas is American, but somehow Hazard manages to look more like Nick Jonas than the other Jonas brothers. Crazy, isn't it? And let's just throw this one in there. Nick's older brother, Kevin Jonas and Mario Goetze. Come on, you see it, don't you? Another one that's pretty easy to see is Arjen Robben and Patrick Stewart. The resemblance is uncanny, even down to the baldness. The English actor just looks like a much older version of Arjen Robben. If the Dutch footballer was in Hollywood, he most definitely would have played Patrick Stewart's son in the movie. And that reminds us of someone else. If Xabi Alonso was in Hollywood, he surely would have played Jason Bateman's brother at some point, because can you see just how much these two look alike? Also, we don't know if this makes so much sense, but we imagine that if Jason Bateman played football, he'd play exactly like Alonso did. You know, always so precise and well calculated with the ball. Speaking of Real Madrid midfielders, Luka Modric looks like David Guetta with hair. When he cut his hair, not so much, but with that falling hair, the Grammy-winning French DJ actually looks like the Ballon d'Or-winning Croatian footballer. And this leads us to another football and Hollywood pairing, wait for it, Pavel Nedved and Owen Wilson. Listen, Nedved is basically just Owen with a sharper jawline. And for those of you that are saying it's just the hair, you are very correct. But you can't deny that the hair alone makes them look like twins. The Hollywood and European football combo is a gift that keeps on giving and it's given us yet another gift with Fabio Vieira and Robert Knepper, you know, teabag from Prison Break. No wonder some of Vieira's teammates call him teabag. Robert is much older, but damn, you have to say that these two really do look alike. If Fabio Vieira ever tried his hands at acting and Robert was asked to play his dad, the man would simply say, hold my pocket. If you got that joke, we want to see you flex on others who didn't in the comments. The resemblance in this next one may not be so striking, but if you look at Lewis Hamilton and Andros Townsend for long enough, you'd see that they sort of look alike. Come on, you see it, don't you? Now we'll end with one we personally find the most interesting because we have a conspiracy theory that goes along with it. Real Madrid defender David Alaba and American rapper Tyler the Creator. First, we can establish that they do look alike, right? Great. Let's now also establish that Tyler was born to a Nigerian father. That is a well-known fact. Another well-known fact is that Tyler, who was born in the US, sadly never got to meet his dad. He has talked about that a few times. Now, Alaba was born two years after Tyler, also to a Nigerian father in a different country. Now, could it be that… nah, surely it couldn't, right? Nah, like we said, this is surely just a conspiracy theory. But then, could it? Nah, no way. But does anybody want to try and debunk our conspiracy theory in the comments? You're free to do so. You can also hit us with your footballer lookalikes. We want more. Anyway, if you enjoyed this video, you already know what to do. Give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. Also, turn on the bell notification so you never miss out on new content. And we'll catch you in the next one. Bye-bye.